¿Cómo estás? Pinche pendeja, vete a la verga Pinche pendeja, mamá verga Pinche pendeja, ¿Cómo estás? Pinche pendeja, vete a la verga Pinche pendeja, mamá verga Pinche pendeja, ¿Cómo estás? Pinche pendeja, vete a la verga Pinche pendeja, mamá verga Pinche pendeja, ea, ea, ea Hola, mamá, mi tiche What is up, you guys? Welcome back to my motherfucking canal ¿Cómo están, amigas? Espero que se la estén pasando rete bien Porque si no, ya saben que aquí estoy yo para entretenerlas, como pueden ver, hoy les traigo otro pinche vlog. And today I was like, you know what? Hoy puto desmadre. Y dije, ¿sabes qué? Me las voy a traer conmigo. Porque yo sé que a ti, sí, a ti te estoy hablando, amiguita. Yo sé que a ti te gusta el puto desmadre. Entonces dije, ¿sabes qué? Chinga su madre, nos vamos juntas. So, hoy, como pueden ver, you guys, by today's title. Hoy vamos a ir a un Halloween party slash birthday party de mi amigo Blessed, o sea, Alex. Hace unas semanas, you guys, nos invitó a su fiesta and I was like, you know what, chinga su madre, vamos a ir. ¿Por qué? Porque a mí me gusta el puto perro y el desmadre. Entonces, si me invitan, yo me apunto y ahí estoy. Ahorita, como pueden ver, aquí está la reina, you guys. If you guys don't know, reina, ella fue la que me hizo el glam de Chucky. Fue la que le hizo el glam a Ursula. Y pues hoy, a mí en Dani nos va a hacer el glam de un School. So, vamos a empezar a maquillarnos Y pues sigan viendo el pinche video Me acabo de sentar aquí en la silla de maquillation Y yo les voy a ser muy honestos, amiga I was having a hard time I didn't know what the fuck I wanted to be And I was struggling because one thing I did know Is that I wanted to have like a matching outfit Con el Dani Originally, we were gonna do like One of us is Joker and one of us is Harley Quinn, right? Dani was like, you be Harley Quinn Like, you do the glam, like, you know how to get ready And all that stuff, pero... Ustedes ya me conocen, ahorita con que estoy perdiendo mucho pelo, amigas I am not down to wear peluca, especially for like a long time Because I've heard that wearing wigs or like anything on your hair Hace que se te caiga más el pelo, entonces I was like, no No podemos hacer nada that's like boy-girl vibes Porque pues no quiero usar peluca Entonces we were stressing out, por poquito le vamos a cancelar a Reina, you guys I kid you not, I was about to Yeah, because I didn't know what the fuck to be And then we wanted to be Shrek And I was like, okay, I just don't want to look like a pintado verde Like I feel like for Shrek you need To get like the big awesome. nose, yeah. like you, really yeah, off. like to really pull it off. Like I wanted it to be iconic, right? And then anoche, I was on my Instagram stories. No me acuerdo whose story it was, pero vi que hicieron como tipo like a skull look. And I was like, you know what, chingue su madre. Yo para estresarme no estoy. I'm not gonna get fucking stressed out. I'm gonna do like a simple glam skull. Y Dani va a ser like a full on like skull skull. So as you can see, I have like a whole head of just curls pinned up. Girl, I was using these like extra voluminous extensions and they're very voluminous. Low key, like I don't even know how many clips I have in my hair. But hopefully my curls stay throughout the whole night. Before I do start my face, I do want to put on my jewelry just so I don't have to stress about that after or anything. So let's put on this chain one. Let's see if it will. Actually, we're just going to do keep it very subtle and cute. My Virgo necklace. Gotta go for the Virgo. I also got these earrings from the Halloween Spirit Store. Danny suggested with the costume that I'm gonna be wearing, which I have not mentioned, it is a witch wizard slash costume vibes. He said that these would fit perfectly with it because it has like star alignment on it and it's blue. So it's just really, really cute. So let's put these on. There we go. All right, earrings are on. Today, I decided that I wanted to be <coughs> a school. No, I'm just kidding. No, I didn't decide. Last minute, Alan was like trying to decide what to do, but he wanted to do all the iconic ones and he wanted me to be the sidekick. <laughs> I'm like, babes, can we both be the main character? I'm just kidding. No, but like on a real note, like he wanted to do like Joker and me be Harley Quinn. I'm a boy. <laughs> I cannot be doing that. I'm just kidding. No, it's just like I'm not I'm not feminine like that. So like it wouldn't sit right with me. You know, it would just look weird. It would look like a man in a girl suit, you know? So um Alan ended up just deciding that we should just do schools and I decided to do the school from Murder House Tate um in American Horror Stories. I actually never thought that I was gonna do something like this because I don't know, I just I have thought about doing it, but like I know I can't accomplish that because I don't I have two left hands. Like I just can't do that. Like art for me is really hard. So I decided that I well I didn't decide. Alan decided that we should get it professionally done. And and that's why she's here. <laughs> okay. Oh this is her Oh okay, okay.
I've never actually done a school like anything, like mm -hmm. ever, mm -hmm. uh huh, yeah. ever. Mm -hmm. I've I've always been like, it's so hard. <laughs> I'm excited though because even though it's gonna be like maybe not like a complex outfit, mm -hmm. I still think it's gonna be super like glam and super bomb. No, I, I, I think, think it's gonna still look good. Your pants literally are like. Are oh yeah, I bought some really bomb ass pants. You guys have Forever 21, que son como tipo esqueleto vibes, and I think they're very glam. I'm between those and like unos que también encontré Forever 21 that are like bedazzled from like head to toe, like los pantalones, mm -hmm. like they're like bell bottoms. But oh okay. Sabrá which one we end up doing. We did end up going to Sephora. So let me show you guys a few things that I did end up getting. So the total that I spent at Sephora was about $100. Not too bad, but it is expensive, okay? I ended up getting the Professional, the small mini size, just because, you know, like, um, I couldn't afford the bigger one at the moment, okay? Let's just be honest. I got this. I ended up getting the um, Urban Decay Last La Wow La Long Lasting Makeup Setting Spray. I can't talk, but I got one mini one as well, so portable, so it could be cute and easy to take around with me. And literally my all-time favorite primer, no fucking joke. I will literally stand by this. I do not care. It works for me. The Patrick Star Primer, the sweatproof one, is amazing. I literally bought two. Loki, the first one finished pretty quickly, and I've been using it really often. So this is definitely a must-have in my makeup bag. So highly suggest it and the store that we went to was the only store that had it around us so they were fully stocked it was the one in Cerritos guys so yeah have you ever been to those places where they do like 15 minute um oil changes mm -hmm. <gasps> yeah you have i know i've heard oh my know. god so there's one right here in the in my in the corner of my house and i've never been i always go to the jeep dealership because like you know my car's a jeep so like i don't want to go somewhere where like you know like you i just yeah trained, yeah either. so like i just and I already know the pricing and I just trust them. Like, I just, I just didn't feel like trying somewhere new. Anyways, but today my car has been needing an oil change and I have been dreading to go because I know for a fact that I have to leave my car there for like a fat ass minute. Mm -hmm. And like, I won't get my car back because they're so goddamn slow. And so I ended up going to this one by my house and it says it's done in 15 minutes. And I call them and I'm like, are you sure it's 15 minutes? Cause I have things to, to do. To <laughs> yeah. And he's like, yeah, I'll have it done in 15 or 20 minutes. I was like, all right. So I go, didn't expect much. I was like, okay, like I put my window down and I get there and the guy's like, okay, so what are we doing today? And I was like, oh, an oil change. And he's like, okay. He's like, well, this is a, actually a drive through oil change. And I was like, what do you mean? And he's like, yeah, let me just get some information from you. And I was like, all right. I was like, well, this is pussy. It sounds sketchy. So, yeah. So then he goes, so he goes, okay, what's your name? And then he's like, uh, what did he say to me? He's like, okay, so this is actually one of those oil changes you don't have to get out of your car. So you can just stay in your car and we'll do your oil change. And they're like, pop the hood. And I was like, all right, I'll pop the hood. I pop the hood. And the guy's already doing my oil change. Not only is he not doing my oil change, but he's taking out my air filter. And he's showing me, bitch, my filter from like just the engine. Like, I guess it's like a filter for like an engine or something. I don't know. I I don't fucking know. As long as my car is running, that's all I know. They said something about a filter inside. And I'm heard it was a filter that they're lying about and they sold it to me. But I don't think so. They seemed really nice about it. But he showed it to me. It was black, girl. Black. I swear to God, I have not changed it since I got my car. And I got my car in 2018. We are in 2023, girl. It was black. So, like, he... Like, I wasn't thinking about changing it at all. I wasn't right. even thinking about, like, doing it. But he kind of made me feel embarrassed, <laughs> like that my no, 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 that was so black. Cause I was like, why did you even take it out of the first place? <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Like, I know what you're trying to do. Yeah, <laughs> like I know what you're trying to do. So I was like, you know what? Fuck it. I was like, how much is it? And he's like, thirty four ninety nine. I was like, all right. He's like, okay. They started doing it, and then before I even say yes about anything, they start doing everything else. But like, it sounded really good. <laughs> like they were like, oh. 
I can change your 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 wheels from your back to your front because they're gonna wear down mm -hmm. instead of doing a tire rotation because it's gonna cost you around the same thing. Mm -hmm. And I was like, okay, we'll do it. So then he's like, all right. And then they started doing it right away, dude. They had like six people doing my car at the exact same time. One of those little Yes, I felt so cool. And you could, I'm literally in the car and my, I'm like, oh, oh, I don't know what the fuck. So then, then he ends up being like, oh, also, you know, complimentary, we do check your, uh, your cabin air filter. And I was like, all right, well, I guess. I was like, sure, complimentary, oh, go ahead and check it. Oh, you were yes. there. So then he's like checking it, right? And I didn't think anything of it. Mind you, I did not, have not changed it since 2018. <gasps> it comes out black. <laughs> and you guys, no, look, 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 Looks this was up. black. This is this is mine. How it looked. This is a new one. <laughs> you guys, you guys can see it because it's so white. He's like, um. So how like. Been driving around like this? Yeah. I was like, wait. So like, I'm. Is my car like, like poisonous? Ah, uh, like, am I like not breathing fresh air? He's like, pretty much. I was like, all right. Well, just do it. He's like, you don't even want to know the price. I was like. Well, how much is it? And he's like, 34 I was like, that's with installation? He's like, yeah. I was like, all right, let's no, do it. No. So then at the end, I got an oil change, tire rotation, cabin air filter, um, and then another air filter. And then they did, they put tire in my pressure and they also added that's like the windshield though. in 20 minutes. That's good that you found them. Mm -hmm. okay, that's I know, now I won't go on it over there. And I spent around the exact same time, exact same amount you know what? No. I would have. I remember one time I went to the Jeep dealership and they told me the exact same thing. And tell me why? It was almost $800. I only paid $200 here with an oil change. I think that's iconic. That is iconic. You guys, por primera vez nos estamos haciendo the inner corner like wing liner. Y yo quedé como bien en shock. Yo he tratado de hacerme este look y nunca me queda. Y la reina le está quedando. Tip, tip, tip. When you do do it, when you try it, do it before you, obviously if you're doing your, your eyeshadow before your face makeup, that way if you have any room for air, you can like sharpen it up and clean with it concealer. With, with concealer or like a makeup wipe. Yeah, like that. Uh-huh. Give me a smaller brush. This one, this one, this one, this one. I'm doing it right now, right? Mm -hmm. I have thought about doing it, but like... I mean, guys, I just got done with my glam. Uh -huh. And aquí le estoy ayudando a la Irma porque quiero que mi amiga se mire bien perra. I know. I was even telling them that I was getting a little scared because I was like, oh my God, hopefully it turns out. But I'm like, trust the process. Trust the process. Did you see mine, though? I haven't yet. <gasps> oh, yeah. I love it. So bomb. We're gonna go ahead and get this Danessa Myrix palette, you guys. And I'm gonna go ahead and I'm thinking maybe like this purple or this. This one. I like this. Maybe. Or, no, I like this one. No. Let's see. Oh my god. Look. Look open. Oh, babe. That that's mama. beautiful. What the f Fudge. I love that. I don't 
think I would have like blended it out that quickly like how you did it, Loki. I would have probably still be blending. <laughs> Look at it. Do you like that? Ooh, that is so pretty. With, with the black? Um, just with the corners. So I'll darken that. I'm gonna go here too. To give it very much. No eyeliner? Mm, I don't think it no, needs huh? it. No, huh? Because it's already black. You're already smoking it out. I think it looks bomb. Like, Dude, no, it actually really it looks actually goes with the Literally, that's this is how I envisioned it. Like, not gonna lie, this is literally how I envisioned it. So, thank you. Friend. And then you still wanna. Boo! And. <laughs> As all white chicks. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no. Wow, amigas, ahí como pueden ver, ahí está quedando el maquillation. I'm not gonna lie, you guys, lo único que me da hueva is the drive. Ahorita chequé the location, like how far I am from it, and I think we're like an hour and a half. Y esto que ya es un poquito tarde, you guys, so that's why I feel like we're glamming early. Ahorita son las seis y media, and we want to leave como esto de las nueve. Nueve y media más tardar, like be ready by nine, y irnos a la verga a las nueve y media. That way llegamos allá como a las diez y media, once. Because I feel like for Halloween parties, la gente no va llegando hasta como las 10, 10 y media. Tampoco no queremos llegar ahí a las 7 cuando dice que empieza la fiesta. ¿Por qué? Porque vamos a ir a ayudarle a Bless Sebastián. Tampoco. Yo voy de invitado. Ah, no de empleado. Ah, so like that's why I don't even want to get early. I also feel like when you get too early, it's kind of awkward because you're all like, like trying to entertain. Yeah, because then you just feel like you have to wait for everyone to get there. Like, mm -hmm. ¿Qué y no, amigas, yo quiero llegar ya cuando el desmadre ya está empezando. Ah, So I'm actually wearing the lashes from Foxy Bay, right? Foxy? No, I'm watch I'm wearing the lash style Foxy from the Lash Bar, the one that Alan always wears. So they look really good. I am currently priming, so I put a hydrating one. I'm putting a redness one. I am kind of yeah. like rushing a little bit because I feel like I'm not. I don't really have a lot of time because it's currently 8.10 and I want to try to be done by 8.45 so I could change, put my fajan and everything on. Actually, I should actually try to put my fajan right now. But oh, yeah. I'm going to prime real quick and then do that roll. And then do all of that. And then I'm going to open up my primer. This tiny ass one that was like $16. I should have just gotten the bigger one, but okay, whatever. Who cares? A little goes a long way. I got these at TJ Maxx for $14 each one. So I have a second one at home. I always gotta restock on the bomb ass primers. Especially when they have a good price cut, girl. I'm so excited for my costume, low-key. Like, I've never really thought about being a witch, but like this this one was like, oh my god, that's actually like really cute. I'm so down. So I'm excited. That primer is done. This is what I mean that I needed a new primer because this is the one size one that I got. There's like nothing, nothing, nothing. Well, maybe we'll see, but that's literally all that there is left. That's it. I literally used up the whole primer and I bought two more because it's that good. I might need to put more though, Loki. Let's warm that up and just brace on the skin. It works amazing. 
You really have to rub it in until you feel it very tacky on the skin. So you have to work it in. Cause it's literally like a whole film. So don't be scared. I am gonna open a new fucking bottle. I'm so excited. I cannot wait. Oh. I like using fresh bottles. I feel like they, it's like a refresh. Use the tapadera to open it and put a little bit more. That was a lot, but the more the merrier. But you don't want to put too much because then it lends, tends to crumble up. So let's not hope it doesn't do that to me. Now that I have my primers in, I'm gonna go and put on my faja. 20 minutes later. Okay, before I start on my face, I had to put on my faja. So she is snatched. Now let's start on with the face. I am literally using the Kat Von D foundation. This is in the shade Light 021, and I actually really like this foundation. It's very lightweight, but it has coverage. So very, very highly recommend. Oh no, just kidding, I'm gonna do my under eye. So we're gonna do that carefully somehow. Now that I have the black liner on, let me get a small tiny brush. I'm gonna get the color black. I actually learned this from Milan, but I'm observing him, is like placing the color first under where the waterline is and then blend it out after with the smaller brush. So it's just me not being patient and trying to take hella shortcuts, but that's what we're doing right now. then just get a small brush like this and blend it out on the underline. It doesn't matter if it's messy because I still work on my face after and I kind of cleaned it up a little bit. So this technique has worked best for me and I like not putting concealer close to my eye under the eye because I have a lot of wrinkles and when I put concealer under there, it just creases. So I'd rather cover that up with eyeshadow. Ahorita ya llevamos the line work. It looks so fucking dope. No sé si se recorrió, pero si no se recorrió fue porque queremos concentrarnos. Ah, no se la crean. I think I forgot to press fucking record. Pero ahí la llevamos. Miren qué perro le está quedando esta reina. So we're going to continue and then we're going to start adding the gems en un poquito. Now to the foundation. Shake her up and just one, two, three, four. These are like light pumps that I do on my face just so I could evenly spread it out a little bit with my airbrush. Where is it? With my Tarte foundation brush. I love this so much. Like, even though it leaves streaks sometimes, that's where I go in with the Beauty Blender after and it's perfect. So see how much coverage that did on that end with just a little bit of foundation? Some people don't think it's a little bit of foundation, but I got, my face just got used to it. I want coverage, but not my feel, but not let my face feel heavy. That's where I get issues. That's where my face starts to not cooperate with me. get like a small brush like this and kind of blend it out a little bit because I nearly got it on my eyeshadow on the under eye and I don't want it to blend into that too much.
let's move on to cream so i've been doing this thing with the contours i just put a little bit there a little bit there and i just blend it out and it gives it more of a, like a oh, illusion and i feel like it gives it more of like a like i don't know if you guys could see that but i don't know i like it i like this trick it helps me not put too much product but puts product I use the Rare Beauty Cream Blush. I absolutely love this. I've been using it like crazy. I'm already hitting pad. This blush, I fucking am obsessed with. A little goes a long way. As you can see. Okay, I think I'm gonna bronze up a little more because I feel like we need a little bit more bronze. We're trying to look a little skinny. Is that enough? I want to put more. Oh my god. I have an addiction with bronzer, I feel like. Like, I just wish I could be skinny and, like, just have a natural contour. Because I will probably be happy by then. Uh... Cool. I think our face is pretty bronzed and blushed out. Uh, uh, excuse me. Before I set my face with the powder, I go over the bronzer or the contour and bronze up. But I do it like intense because the other way it's gonna like diffuse once you add your powders on top. So yeah, I just feel like it lays and like sets better. Y'all could correct me if I'm wrong. I could just be delusional. Blush that I've been loving is this neutral one, but I think we're gonna mix both or just use this one. Well, we're just gonna mix both. So just gonna do that. Like that. Oh my god, that's very heavy. Ooh, heavy handed there, I see Irma. Alright, she said I'm going all in. No, that's low key a lot. No, me pasé la verga. Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna have to put my bronzer to kind of even out. Me looking crazy? <laughs> I literally look on dude. I look fucking crazy. No, okay. Whew, hold on. So perfect. Yeah. I'm so horny now. Ah. Okay, amigas, ahora para pestañas, yo voy a usar my favorite lashes of all time. Siento como que ya las tengo hartas. Siento como que ya cállate los hocico, Alan. Pero es que la verdad, la pura neta del planeta, me encanta esta pestaña. This is the Lash Bar Lay Foxy Lash. Miren qué bonita está esta pestaña. It's pretty much like a half lash, but like an extreme like half lash. Y me encanta here. use a translucent powder and I'm gonna use this like squared triangle brush and just kind of do that I really like that like chiseled out Trixie Mattel like contour that she does it's so like bomb I fucking enjoy it I want to be drag queen you know what? I am a drag queen uh -huh. Under the eye, press that in. Pressing it in is very important just to make sure it literally stays stuck on your face. So, another trick that I've done time. And then, whatever leftover, or sometimes I just go like around it a little bit and kind of like, you know, 
and just lightly do the rest of my face because I don't want to have too much of a white cast but you know I'm gonna use a bigger brush Oops. whatever is left on the cap just go down all on here Now with my Patrick Star One Size Powder in the shade Light 1R, I'm gonna go in with my brush and just kinda like pat it on top. Bring some color back into my light. Ah, okay, now that we look matte as fuck, I love feeling and looking matte, so. I am down for it. I think I do want to add a little... Let's do my brows next, actually. So I'm going to do my brows and I'll be right back. I opened up my little setting spray. I'm going to clean my lips. Lips are cleaned. Let's shake her up. Spray her a few times. There we go. And we dry. That is so beautiful. It's crazy how like a white shimmer could make a huge difference in the inner corner, honestly. I love it. Damn, bitch, she looks glam. I'm bringing as it in. Fuck. Just so you can... Which is your powder one? This uh, one? This one. Wow, you dude. It? Like it? Oh, that looks bomb, you guys. Pretty now I'm gonna figure out my lips. Well, I'm gonna brush my teeth and then do my lips. So I'm using this nude that I found on Alan's table. It's called Sand. It's a lip contour stick by, I don't know who it's in say. Just like that, you get like an ombre nude cute combo. So I'm gonna be using that for today. And now it is time to actually remove my curls. This is the full glam, the full look. It looks absolutely amazing. I feel fabulous. I feel bomb as fuck. Like, who is this bitch that you're talking to right now? Because I know it's not damn Irma. She a whore. I'm just kidding. I don't know. But yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and remove this and show you guys the final look with the costume. We are pretty much done. This is the final look for me. I love it. I love it so much that I'm going to come on my face tonight. You guys, este es mi look. Yo sé lo que van a decir. Ay, Alan, que simple. Well, let me just tell you guys, I had some like jeans que eran como tipo esqueleto and then like a shirt but I feel like it looked weird like I don't know the body wasn't giving so I was like you know what I'm gonna put something that's very comfy and then I put on these gloves y aquí está el maquillaje Huzzah motherfuckers bippity bopity boo I am a witch a wizard whatever you want to call it I am Loki obsessed with my outfit I landed helped me with my eyeshadow a little bit Danny did suggest these earrings that he saw at the Spirit Halloween store so I am literally obsessed I even have my Doc Martens on and my little wand I don't know I'm just literally living my wizard fantasy so see you Alerta. Porque tengo los millones, chones, 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 chones. Porque tengo los millones, chones, 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 chones. Porque tengo los millones, tengo los millones, tengo los millones, tengo los millones. Porque tengo los millones, tengo los millones, tengo los millones, tengo los millones. Porque tengo los millones, che, 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 che. Porque tengo los millones, che, 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 che. Nada no me hace feliz, pero a ti falta yo juego con mi lambo y se mira en tu la banca. Ego centrico como el pana. Esto me hago porque la meta está muy alta. Vamos a volar, a volar, a volar. Vamos a volar, a volar. Vamos, vamos a volar, a volar, a volar. Donde estoy pegado, donde tú no cascarás. Vamos a volar, que nos somos de la tierra. Llegó la alienígena para darle todo que 
guerra Es que está esperado, siempre es el que me abrirá Si no lo ha luchado, aquí mismo te entiende Es como yo chocado, te lo manda pa' lavado Como ahora día pa' brillar en todos lados Yo no soy un millo y eso no come putao Soy un millo billo y chico Porque tengo los millones, chones, 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 chones Porque tengo los millones, chones, 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 chones Porque tengo los millones